And we begin with this tonight. Picture this. Your three-year-old child is excited to ride the school bus for pre-K, but for two days in a row, the adults in charge miss your child. So your kid doesn't make it home when you expect her to. One mom says that that's what happened to her family. And as New Braunfels ISD investigates that situation, the night team Zaria Oates sits down with the family. This is Camila. She's three years old and already loves pre-K. Even though it's the first week of school, she's already faced some pretty big challenges. Bus arrived and she wasn't on the bus. You see, after school, Camila has to get on one bus from her preschool to another elementary school. That's where she's supposed to get off the first bus and onto a second bus to go home. But two days in a row, that didn't happen. I felt like she was kidnapped, you know. Her mom is choosing not to show her face amid an investigation into this incident. On Wednesday, her mom called the school about Camila not getting off the bus and they told her that Camila was sitting in the office and they never took her to get on the bus. So I got kind of upset because they never called me to, t to notify me that she was at the school. On Thursday, Camila didn't get off the bus after school once again, this time for a different reason. I was called to school in a hurry and they said that they didn't have her. So she called 911. I think it was like 20 minutes, 30 minutes, you know, thinking, where is she? You know, nobody, nobody, not one school, not the other school. Nobody had her. And then about 356, the school calls and says, we have her. We found her on the bus. It's a situation New Braunfels ISD says they're investigating. The district statement reads in part, at this time, we can assure the student was under the supervision of an NBISD staff member at all times. We take the safety of our students very seriously. But her mom says her child was alone. No, uh, they said that they told the bus driver to check and then the bus driver went and checked and she was on there. And those air, those buses don't have air conditioning. Camila is a girl of few words, but she did tell me how this made her feel. How did it make you feel? Sad. Sad? Yeah. Why didn't it make you feel sad? Because my brother went out there. Camila's mom is keeping her off the bus until she gets more answers as to how all of this even happened. Zaria Oates, KSAP 12 News.